Hello, good afternoon my friends, how are you today? So I'll give you a bit of a look at my half tracks. First of all, we'll look at the AFV Club one. So last night I just lazily put on some of the old AFV Club decals. They're very old and they don't really go on that well. See, they look pretty shit. I'll, I'll cover them in um, some gloss. We'll see if we can make them look, blend in a bit better. But no matter what I would do, they just wouldn't fully set right. And my suspicion is they're just too old. They're just too old. But she's looking all right though. Um, I'm not too worried about the decals. I'll get them looking good. But uh, she is starting to look really nice. I like it. Not as good as the dragon one. I like that one better, but it's good. Decent, yeah. They're, they're dating though. Um, nice, and they would have been awesome back in 2004 or whatever they were done in. But yeah, it's starting to date a bit. It's just getting a bit too old. And it was very warped. So, but yeah, got it all together. And there's no gaps in it or anything, so. Seems all good. Very brittle. There was a break there in the drive line. You see, I've had to put a shit ton of super glue on the wheels and shit just to make them stop breaking. And I don't know if that's the plastic they used or if it's just old plastic, but I'm not sure. So last night I was just sitting on this thing, just doing all this sort of really fine black pin washing to get a real mouldy kind of look. So that's really started to dirty it up. And that's the initial dirtiness. And that's an obsession. Oh yeah, I painted them as well. I'll put green on that side and red on that side. And then we've got this side. So I'm just starting to open these up. I put some dirt on the wheels, used pastels, so I just use pastels and you just crush them up and you can just start putting it on with a dry brush. Looks pretty good, but it's just the start sort of thing, just dusting it. So then I can open up these and we can start working on that on the inside of these things here. But yeah, just the amount of D. I'll put some Molotov cocktails in there. I think they're Molotov cocktails. I've got a whole crate of them down the bottom there. I don't know what they are. They came in um, this pack here. These things. Whatever they are. What are they? Petrol bombs or something? Don't know, whatever they are, put them in. And I might make use these decals here to make up a mine sign to put next to it or something see what other mini art boxes we've got you all right elsie what's wrong you okay you want to scratch there you go i think i've got other ones like there's i'll have to order some more i love these mini art accessory boxes yeah i've got a beer bottle one i've got that one but i'll have to get some more i'll order some more in so we can put more little accessories on the models. But yeah, I like it. So uh, I also got this light on. I mean, the night light. That was really cool. It's got a little photo etch thing underneath, but you won't be able to see it. No, you won't be able to see it. It's just because it, I've painted it all black. I'll, I'll try and get it to show up, but uh, it's not that important. So, yeah, there you go. I'll, I'm really having a good time with these two half tracks. So, with this one, I'll get the decals on and we'll get them sealed up with some um, acrylic lacquer gloss. And then I'll start, um, I'll put some washes on it. Put some washes on it. Do a bit of chipping. Oh, I'll show you the gun. Get the machine gun as well. Where's that? Oh, here it is. 
assume that's the machine gun for the front. Looks pretty cute. All right, guys, these are the other ones I'm just working on as well. All right, I'll speak to you again soon.